All right, here we go. There he is. I see him. Hmm. There he is. Ah, so you found me. But what do you think you can possibly accomplish now? Bernard, we beat you. Do you have amnesia or something? We beat you and him. Last time, the freshly revived Vile God hadn't regained his full power. But it's different now. This time, I'll erase you all. How convenient. <laughs> Sorry, that's not happening. Harley, now! After all that time, I, I, I know he was doing something dramatic, but I gotta say this. After all that time, you had Fang, Sherman, and Aaron were looking for him. You're telling me he hadn't regained his strength in that time? And then what, like the, oh, it, it took Harley three days. Still, though. The goddess's power again? Vile god! Destroy them! Ooh. Wow, you sound so threatening. Go now! Into the vile god's mouth! Of course. Okay, here we go! Fools! You leap willingly to your doom. How big she? You will be absorbed and die! Wait a minute. Last time I checked, he was not big enough to do that. We don't get a dungeon? Okay, fine. What's wrong? What's happening? What is this? Did they find some way to safely enter the Vile God? No! It can't be! How is that even possible? Like, if anything, I would think he would just chomp down with the sharp teeth and then that'd be the end of it. Oh! So this is the inside of the Vile God. I thought it would be more... gross. Nah, it looks good enough to me. Hmm... most fascinating. It probably means that the Vile God is an organism from a dimension other than our own. Really? Are you trying to link something up here? Or... it may not even be an organism at all. It may be a being of thought, of conceptual entity. I want to take a sample home with me. Because that sounds very much like a CPU. It's good that you're dedicated to your research. But please leave that for later. We have no idea how long we have in here. Okay, so it looks like there is a dungeon. I like that there's a song. I like there's a background. Okay. May have jumped to conclusions too quickly. Oh, no worries there. The amazing faith drop is drawing from the goddess's power. There's no time limit on this one. That's cool, but let's still let's pick up the pace, you know? Of course, the Vile God may do something from the outside. Yeah. That's what we should be worried about more than anything. Alright. <laughs> Something's coming this way! Yeah, because now that I think about it, every time you go inside a villain, that's where it's the most dangerous because that's their own body. What are those? Antibodies? They're likely some sort of defense mechanism meant to remove foreign objects from the body. Yep. Think of them like white blood cells. Mm hmm. Which means they are the enemy. So all we have to do is cut them down. Let's get this over with. Yeah, we don't have time to waste on these jerks. Let's get rid of them and find Tiara. All right, so we got to be fighting inside here. Oh, cool! Here we go. All right. So now we're in an actual. So this is cool. Um, no weaknesses. Let's do. This. All right. Let's do it the classic way then. Or should it? Well, there's three of them, yes. Oh, yeah. Well? Huh. I mean, it looks like we did a lot of damage, but did we really? Wait, are they a boss? I think they have. Yeah, I think they're a boss. Or classified as a boss. Uh. Well, we, I think we can always try, right? Brace yourself. Um, let's see. How how bad is it to? Well, no, actually, Apollonius, you provoke right there. You only got two, I think. Oh wait, whoa! I never noticed that. Ethel gets in an interesting stance when she's about to attack. 
Um, yeah, we definitely want Lola to attack. Well, no. They're not weak to light. Which is odd. You would think they would be. Um... She should have weapons. Oh! They happen to be weak to spears, but no, it's not worth it. It's, my turn. it's not worth it at all. Um... Look, this one over here. Let's go for this one. Oh, this might take a while. One. Oh! But they barely do that much damage. New data. Failing to impress me. Um. I actually forgot after a week to. Well, it doesn't matter. Here. I'll choose. Yourself. Hmm. A miss. But it seems like it will work. I guess we can keep trying it. I'll erase you all. I mean, if it takes one in the mouth, that's way better than, uh, you know. Your soul is dust. <laughs> Let's do this. Although it's supposed to, it, it will do damage too. I have to remember that. Uh, yep. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Lola, we need you at that side as well. And every now and then I have to remind myself. Lola's not fully, uh, nearly maxed out. And of course, neither is Sherman, but, you know, his level easily helps me keep track of that. Alright, Ethel, try to assassinate this one again. Because we're getting the other two. New data. Um, Harley is not ready yet, so... How about some magic? Executing. The power of Earth! Here I come. Hmm. I'll be all right. Although, really, why don't I use Sherman to heal? Does he have a skill? Yes, he does. Never used it. Execute. I don't think. Are you all right? Brace yourself. All right. Um. We could drain. He doesn't need it though. I won't hold back. Die in tragedy. Almost there. This should take care of it. Well, the two of them. Then it would be fantastic if I finally saw Ethel actually assassinate somebody. But. You know, it might not be that this is a boss battle, but that this is, uh, or a dungeon. It's not a dungeon, but it's just a boss battle, and then we find Tiara. You know, because I can only think of antibodies being the enemy in here. Miss. New data. Well, I'm not about to wait and find out. Executing spiral shot. Now then. Time to show off. It's my turn. Uh we could use a heal, Sherman, on yourself, really. Lola can heal herself. Execute. You're good. Or you're not good. Uh, honestly, she's not gonna have enough time, but let's try again. Brace yourself. Never seen it actually work. I guess I can't give her one more shot, especially with everybody fairizing us. My sword is my soul. 
And it doesn't look like we... But we might finish him off. If I, you know, had everybody attack. How about some classic? Yeah. New data. Dang, Harley, not yet ready? Alright, wait. Oh! Give it up. Well, good job, Ethel. I need to become even stronger. Alright. Oh, this is a dungeon! Well. Alright, see. I will give it, like, see, this should have been the real game. Like, these dungeons and everything. So, it, you, you just had a boss. Well, like I said, I couldn't anticipate anything else being the enemy. There might be, like, an advanced version, but, you know. They're, for the most part, just white blood. Well, we'll call them red. No, red blood cells are di are completely different. Looks like that worked. But I gotta see. How tough were these? Executing. The power of Earth. Not tough at all. Yeah, we got this. Um, but that's all she wrote. Oh, because this isn't where we want to go. It's past this way. I wonder what made them decide. So you know, go all out like this is a different um this feels like a different game but it's a shame it's on an alternate path you know because one of the things i will say is my tension has gone down i think with knowing that you know how the first route ended it's like that was the route you know that's that's why i can joke in this one and things like that not that i'm looking at this route as not canon although I mean, people are- I've heard different things, you know. Some have said the first route's canon, and others the third one. I mean, I don't know. And there's an event over there, so let's go over here first. So anything over here in that would interest me? There's a lot. What the heck? The event's right over there, though. Hmm. All right. Well, let's head to the event. Here we are. Damn it! Where is she? Sherman, what about over there? I think. What does she look like? Is she huge inside here? I don't see any sign of her. She may already have been dissolved into the vile god. That can happen. And how would you know that can happen? Don't be stupid. She's not the type to bite the big one so easy. You know that. Besides, Kiwi's still here. Okay, the second thing makes sense. The first one, now, Tiara could very well fit the damsel in distress. She might seem all innocent, but Tiara's a giant, vulgar, stubborn dumbass. She's still hanging in there. You can count on it. Right. I forgot we're dealing with the blue, light blue Tiara. Oh, no! An earthquake! It seems to have passed. Though, I mean, vulgarity does not e equal toughness. Though, that's a different conversation entirely. Huh. Well, I mean, you know, not in real life, but normally, you know, in written works, it does, you know, go with... They're normally not... I mean, let, let's be... There is a difference between this tiara and the one we normally know. And this one does seem a bit tougher. Like I was saying, we're gonna find that idiot, and when we do, that hag is gonna pay for causing us so much trouble. Oh, that's right. Wasn't she trying to kill Fang before? But wait, are you? You're not talking about Tiara as a hag, though, right? I don't know. I don't know. Wait, yeah, because it was Harley who captured Tiara. Yeah, so Harley should have even bigger a bigger mo uh, motivation for doing this. Hmm. It, no, Ethel, it's not an earthquake. And once again, it stopped. Is the vile god perhaps on the move? 
Well, I mean, y you mean figuratively, right? Tiara's got a stupid face. What? What the heck, Harley? Why did you? You think that's gonna? Oh! I should have picked that up a split second sooner, so I could completely cl claim credit that I thought of that. But I did not. So unfortunately, I can't. But I get it. You're talking when t when Fang mentioned called her a hag. She got upset. Hmm. I see. So what are you gonna do about it? I see. What do you see? Tiara's definitely still alive. The Vile God's body is shaking in response to any insults directed at Tiara. But can you separate her from him? Like, how does that work? Ah, that would make sense. Whatever her form may be, some part of her is still conscious. Thinking about it that way, there's still hope. Really? I'm trying to think about how Sherman was uh, in his form. But, I mean, he did look completely different. That's a relief. Then we need to hurry. You think Harley would have made some type of tracker or some something, you know? But anyways, all right. The map does help. I'm not using the road at all. I'm completely using the map and oh. Well, that looks like his heart. Not necessarily a king uh what it, did Harley give these a name? They have names, right? Give me a second. I must protect it all. Here we go. Ah, just the cells. All right, it wasn't like a gigantic cell. That looks more like a heart. And see, look, Harley's the only one who can move uh, before these guys. Ooh, Galdo leveled up. And you, that can happen, really. I need to have everybody getting uh, more experience. I should know this because I'm pretty sure Harley got that achievement too. But again, it's been a while. Wait, wait. Oh, this is what they were talking about. That's probably not going to be the thumbnail because I feel like I said gigantic. Well, you know. I try very hard to make sure my thumbnails and my titles don't spoil stuff. At the same time, I'm realizing more and more that the games I play are old. And because they are, people's interest in them dies down. So, and most people already know. But then again, at the same time, I don't, even if there's like one person who's watching right now who's blind, which I know for a fact that's not the case. I know that for a fact there are people who watch the channel for a long time that are watching and this is their first time. I can't spoil you guys, but at the same time, it's like... Anyways, uh, so yeah, most likely that is not the thumbnail. Most likely I'd use, you know, a scene where they're, you can see the background of where they are because I think that's alluring enough. So, yeah. And plus, YouTube has done this new thing where they're asking you if the um, video is monetizable. So, yeah, anywho. Look, over there! Tiara! Body's trapped. We have to pull her out. Of course, there's a chance her upper half will just come right off. Then why don't we just, you know, like destroy the parts around her, you know? And I was trying to get a look, get look at that uh, pink blob because I was trying to see if I could see her inside. Now I'm, well, no, I, I am pretty sure they wouldn't show that. Now is no time for being creepy. Sherman, help me. We have to get her out of there. Sherman, what's wrong? Before that, there's something else we must do. What's that? Oh, of course. Okay, so this is what I was talking about. What is that? You know... Nope. The vile god considers Tiara part of him. And as such, it's protecting her. Unless we can take care of this... Rescuing her will be impossible. So, like, eight of you? Wait, no, how many are in the party right now? Just seven, I think, right? Yeah, so six of you fight, 
literally six of you fight, and their last person pull out Tiara. Here it comes. Ew, so squirmy. That's so gross. Like, have Lola do it. That's perfect. It doesn't matter. All we gotta do is slash it to pieces. Right, Ethel? Why Ethel? That's weird. <laughs> I hate bugs. But it's not a... It's not a bug. <laughs> Pest control. Mm-hmm. Anywho, um, wait, it's the same thing, right? Oh, no. Probably want to do analysis. It's stronger. Nope. But at least we can see. I could heal, but I mean, eh. Healing's for people who have time for that. Okay, Fang is completely useless. Well, not completely useless, but... He can't weaken. It's my turn. Whatever you want to call this thing. I know I tried swords, but I'm still wondering about that time where I know I tested Fang Sword and it didn't break the guard, but Sherman's did. That still makes me wonder. No way. Fire. Let us begin. All right. Here I come. That's gonna be pretty simple. Here I come. Um, now Sherman probably could. Sherman, turn on some justice. I forgot. You need that in order to keep up. Uh, Ethel. Yeah, go ahead and break it. Get ready. All right, and Fang doesn't even have a serious face on. Eh, turn it on. Here I come. Now I heard. Well, I actually don't remember what I heard. That that silver bar means something different. Let's see. Yeah. Strike. And like, it says break chance, and not that it's broken, but... Executing magical magnum. I mean, it's doing work regardless. Let us begin. Let's just, let's just beat on him. Be quick. You'll feel no pain. Get ready. Eruption Edge. If only we could fair eyes. Executing Gaia Spear. Ah! Here. My turn. <laughs> I want to assassinate, but nah. Um. No point in doing lunatic dance now. By the way, I did notice the clocks before, or whatever those are. Pretty cool. All right, now it's time to pull Tiara out of there. Well, that's good timing. I already am. Bahas, you grab right there. White. Okay. Got it. Pull on two. One. Two. <sighs> Thank goodness. It looks like her lower half is okay. Yeah, I can see that. Definitely no question. But you know, I don't think we should let the boys see this. Turn around, you guys. You know, I think you're a little late. Just just a little late. What are you talking about? We need to make sure she's okay and I think she like I've well, oh, I don't know what I would have done in this situation, especially in my previous state that I was. My beautiful eyes. Serves you right, pervert. Okay, 
can we talk about that for a second? Like, there's a difference between, you know, happening to walk it. Like, it's been a stereotype in anime, and it's been, it gets to me. Like, so many, especially nowadays, people just toss the word around willy-nilly. You know, those people are scum, okay? But being a guy, there, there, there's being a guy, and then there's that, all right? Fang just, and then Fang wasn't even doing either of those things. He was literally just like, I want to make sure she's okay. Like, why do we, why do we got to go that route, all right? I'm just saying. I just wanted to make sure she was okay, idiot. Yeah, he didn't. He didn't deserve it this time. This is bad. She's not waking up. She's still breathing, but. Yo, Sherman. <laughs> Sherman. Whoa, no. That, that's not right now. So he, he's clearly. Respiration and pulse are stable. There are no external injuries. Oh, well, I'm actually curious. So. No, I mean they got Harley, honestly. Like, I would just trust Harley to let us know what the deal is, but, like, what if something had happened, you know? I get where Fang's coming from. See, that's why I'm, I'm wondering, I'm like, would I have instinctively, because that's what I normally do, you know? I Like, I instinctively, I had that instinct to turn away. That's, you know, the whatever part of me. I, I get, you know, I just err on the side of caution. It's, it, it's instinct. But... If it's somebody I'm worried about, and I'm like trying to figure out if they're okay, would I turn- Like, it shouldn't even make that big, big of a deal, okay? Especially not in this place, but... Hey! So what, Sherman gets the law? Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that, that's not right. Like, literally, the only person- Because, who do we have in our party? I'm pretty sure Pippin- They don't count Pippin, right? Oh, Apollonius. But, uh, would, would he care? Like, I don't- I mean, obviously he wouldn't care. Of course! He doesn't have an indecent bone in his body! Okay, no. You, no, you see... Look, I don't wanna... I don't wanna sound... What is it? Um... It's not cocky. Mmm... Alright. I'm just gonna say, probably... More than most... I am one of the people who doesn't do that sort of thing. Like I just told you, it's an instinct for me not to... Like, I, I, it, maybe it's because of how I was trained as a kid. You know, that could be it as well. Anyways, I'm just trying to say, unless... Even... No, 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 no. If somebody has... If a guy has no interest in girls at all, that doesn't mean they're not indecent. Alright, that just means they're not interested in girls. But I feel as if I'm one of the... I mean, you guys have to tell me, but that's why I get... Anyways, anyways. Um, I'm just... I say all that to say that's completely false. Alright, especially some of the things... In fact, some of the things that Sherman says makes me go, Sherman, what have you done? Like, what, like there was an incident. Alright, I'm gonna... I, we'll talk about this, alright? When, um... And mentioned he, I think he like woke up next to some uh somebody and he forgot what her name or he called her by a different name. People were saying, I think you know they were wondering like why wouldn't he, why wouldn't I get why someone would be upset about that? But no, what I was thinking about is why were they like was that like a a previous you know well I guess a current ex of Sherman's, and if he called her by another name, does that mean he had two? You know, does that mean... Well, anyways, that was my mentality. I was thinking less upon the surface and more, you know, what has Sherman been doing? So, see? Well, anyways. So, I mean, I'm just saying, there are there is guys who are respectful, but if they're interested in girls, the guys are guys, all right? Which I'm pretty sure most of you know. I mean, a good number of you are... All are worse than me, all right? I can say that. Damn it! I still can't get my eyes to open! She poked her eyes. I thought she did. That, that's so messed up. Like, he's showing genuine concern. If you want Fane to close up! Well, at least she's safe for now. There's nothing we can do for her here, so it's about time we got out. Like, at least 
Sherman or Fang both were wearing jackets. They could easily take it off and give it to her. Hmm. I suppose it would be a bit presumptuous to try to battle the Vile God right now. Would it? I mean, you know where he is. You might not get this chance again. You're inside of it. Matter of fact, find his core. Destroy his core. Soji, could you carry the young lady? Okay. Yeah, sure. Of course, Pippin. Why not? Now just hold on a second. Soji doesn't count either. He's not just looking, he's actually touching her. Yeah, yeah, like, um, th 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 that does see. But he, he is a fairy, to be fair. And Pippin isn't human. But either way, it's just a concept. Hey, I mean, look, at this point, you know, I'd, I'd say, I, I don't know. Kinds of creepy impulses. Now, no, see, no. All right, look. I, so, I I can say this because I am so confident in who I am. That's not creepy. That's just a guy being a guy. All right. It's not creepy. It's not creepy at all. Now, some guys do take it to a creepy level. But I don't, but you can tell Fang, like literally, Fang had the most innocent response he's ever had. He's like, I just want to see she's okay. Correct. I have absolutely no interest in the female body. But see, like, that's what I was just saying. That doesn't mean. Although, Soji, to be fair, I would trust, I would say Soji is definitely more of a, could fit that bill more than Sherman. Soji's a mythical creature, you know, despite looking human. Um, but with cer certainly something does interest you, right, Soji? I mean, he, to be fair, he's also Pippin's fairy. You know, it, yeah, yeah, Soji, I could trust, but like Sherman, nah, nah, that, that's that's biased at, at at its fullest. Okay, sure, but Pippin's, well, he's never mind. I I don't know what Pippin is, but but what about Apollonius? All right, well, at least the game, hey, the game's asking the questions I want to know. Apollonius, though, I like again. I don't think he cares. Wait, no, wait. What am I saying? What am I saying? <laughs> he he he's trained himself. See, like I feel like Apollonius is. Well, no, 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 no. no. See, Apollonius has been a way too far. If you are isolate, if you isolate yourself, yeah, we go have this conversation. All right, we go have this conversation. If you isolate yourself for a long period of time, then when you encounter it again, and it's You know? Yeah, uh, you know what? I, I'm not sure when this episode is, is- Wait, let me look at my time. I don't know if this is my second episode or third episode. I might have done something special for you guys, I don't know. But there's no way this episode is not coming out. I'm gonna tell you guys, alright? Episode 10.5 in the year. Just real quick. It's an episode similar to this. But on a different scale. Okay, so I'm gonna say if you're watching this right now and you found this conversation even the least bit interesting, go watch that. All right, just for me. All right, I, I, I just you'd enjoy it. All right, that's the only reason why I'm telling you. Anyways, Apollonius has been training, but that doesn't mean that is far from meaning it's, especially since he's given in to you know joining the party everything he can to keep his eyes closed right right yeah i see that would be me all right that would be me exactly yeah i feel like that that sounds like i would or at least i would turn away i would from the instant i saw the state you know what i would like have instantly have turned away so i get that that's me i'm gonna ask you know question of the day which which one of you guys i already know which one of you guys you no, no, no. You guys aren't in this situation. Because I know what you guys would be doing. And it's not what Fang would be doing. So. Worldly desires be gone. Yeah. Worldly desires be gone. Yeah. Worldly desires be gone. Worldly desires be gone. That is pretty much me now that I think about it. <laughs> that is pretty much me. He's surprisingly perverted. No, hey, hang on, hang on, hang on. That's not what I said. Okay. That is, that, that is not what I'm... Ethel, you were putting... Especially considering Ethel has 2B's voice right now. Oh my goodness, she does stuff like that. Okay. Um, maybe I should not do that move anymore. You know what? I, at this point, you know, I just need to... 
Just need to roll with it. My goodness. No, that is. You know, I might have to. No, I've already made the video. I'm not. I'm not remaking it to add Ethel's voice. Why well, could? I still have the files, but for um, just in case something happens to the video, I didn't need to explain that. Okay, let's get out of here. I'll set our coordinates to a nice, safe distance. And there. You can do that? Like, seriously, why didn't you put a tracker on it? Whoa, is there anything you can't do? The, yes, keep, see, uh, no, 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 all right, see, uh, this is what I'm talking about, right? Let's take, let's take a look at Harley. Like, well, we don't know if she's interested in guys or not. But you can best be sure that, you know, that doesn't mean she doesn't have, like, Harley's the, I think, I think Harley's the worst person out of the entire group. But yeah, she's surprisingly considerate. Well, it's only really, I think, is it only fairies? Because she doesn't react to Ethel. I think it is only fairies. Never underestimate my scientific capability. Of course, it's a one-time function only made possible by the power of the faith drop, but... Why does it even have that ability? Like, that has nothing to do with its original purpose, does it? Here we go! Well... And now it's time for the question of the day. And for this one, I'm going to ask, who do you think are the top two most and least pure-hearted out of the entire group? That includes the fairies as well. All right. Uh, so yeah, um, and you can do more than two. You can do the whole scale if you want to. I just had to say more than one because I feel like there are some obvious choices or at least, you know, very popular obvious choices. Um, and I'm thinking about it, I'm like, you know, it, it's actually, uh, it actually kind of makes you think. And, you know, it was the main talk of this episode, so I had to ask that as a question. So please, post your thoughts down in the comments below, and I will see you all, hopefully, for the video I was talking about. But, you know, if not, then next time.